Bronchitis is an inflammatory condition of the bronchial tubes, the airways that carry air to the lungs. It typically arises due to an infection or other factors that irritate these air passages. This condition is characterized into two types, acute bronchitis and chronic bronchitis, each differing in causes, duration, and potential complications. This video covers the medical definition and provides a brief overview of this topic, so if you're ready, let's get into it. Acute bronchitis is more the common type and is often caused by the same viruses that lead to colds and the flu. Usually manifests rapidly and is temporary, with symptoms lasting for a few weeks. The primary symptom of acute bronchitis is a cough, which may bring up clear, white, yellow, or greenish mucus. Other symptoms might include sore throat, body aches, breathlessness, fatigue, and a mild fever. Typically, the condition is self-limiting, meaning it resolves on its own without the need for extensive medical intervention. Treatment primarily aims at relieving symptoms and may include rest, increased fluid intake, pain relievers, and sometimes cough medicine. Antibiotics are not recommended for treating acute bronchitis caused by a viral infection since they do not combat viruses. Chronic bronchitis, on the other hand, is a more serious condition and is defined as a productive cough that lasts for at least three months, recurring for two consecutive years. It is a type of COPD and is primarily caused by long-term exposure to irritating gases or particulate matter, most often from cigarette smoke. Individuals living in areas with high air pollution or who are frequently exposed to dust and fumes at work are also at higher risk. Symptoms of chronic bronchitis include a persistent mucus-producing cough, wheezing, shortness of breath, chest discomfort, and frequent respiratory infections. Treatment for chronic bronchitis is more complex and focuses on managing symptoms and preventing complications. Quitting smoking is the most crucial step for those who are smokers. Medications may include bronchodilators that help open the airways, steroids to reduce inflammation, and antibiotics for bacterial infections that may occur alongside the bronchitis. In severe cases, oxygen therapy and pulmonary rehabilitation might be necessary. The pathophysiology of bronchitis, whether acute or chronic, involves inflammation and the subsequent narrowing of the bronchial tubes. This inflammation stimulates the production of mucus, which can block or narrow the airways, leading to cough and difficulty in breathing. For acute bronchitis, the inflammation is typically resolved with the clearing of the infection, whereas in chronic bronchitis, the inflammation persists, leading to more permanent respiratory issues. Preventative measures against bronchitis include avoiding smoking, minimizing exposure to pollutants, and practicing good hygiene to prevent the spread of viruses. It also involves getting vaccinated against influenza and pneumococcal pneumonia, which can prevent infections that may lead to bronchitis. Regular physical activity and a healthy diet can also strengthen the immune system, helping to fend off the infections that cause acute bronchitis. But, as you can see, understanding bronchitis and differentiating between its acute and chronic forms is crucial for effective management and treatment. Each requires a different approach to care and lifestyle adjustments, underscoring the importance of medical guidance in managing this condition. If you want to support the channel, please like and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it. And there should be some other helpful videos popping up on your screen right about now that I think you will enjoy. And just a quick reminder, we are not doctors. This video is for informational purposes only. Thank you so much for watching. Have a blessed day. And as always, breathe easy, my friend.